Hey everybody, it's Lenny LaRocca again with the LaRocca Real Estate Group here. So today I want to talk a little bit about the misnomer about what's happening with the economy, partly influenced by, of course, the pandemic. And then, of course, everybody thinks that there's a wave of foreclosures that's coming down the road. Well, I can't speak for the other states in the U.S., but I can speak specifically in California. So the estimation is that we're going to see an astronomical uh, for you know REOs and forbearances on, on property loans. And the fact is that's just not happening. There are two economic factors that are required for a foreclosure. Number one is financial hardship. And number two, um, a lack of, equ of equity. Now, for the people that actually lived through the Great Recession back in 2006, eight, and nine, if you will, um, the problem that we had there was everybody was, um, they had very little of equity in their home. And of course, not talking about the mortgage industry and the banking industry. So we had a lot of REO uh, activity then. Not gonna be the case in the current time. Uh, in fact, what's happened since then is we've had a 11, 12 year market uprun and the equity gain that most people have in their home, like me and I'm, I'm assuming you, is uh, greatly increased. So you're just not going to see a lot of foreclosures and a lot of that was expected in the economic forecast. It's just not going to happen. Also, as we also know that the banks have offered some forbearance opportunities for those homeowners. You know, that is not a simple equation. And so if you are looking at a forbearance situation, you must give me a call. And we need to talk about the realities of that because what sounds like a simple way of getting out of a mortgage, it is not simple. So you need to understand what you could consider uh, signing up for, and it may not be in your best interest. Um, I have a couple of reports here that talks a little bit about the unemployment and things like that, and how, whether or not we will see a repeat again of the Great Recession of 2006. Uh, 789. We're just not going to see that. And I hope you guys understand that. This is a different time. We're in a different time. We just started 2021. The market remains reasonably strong. Interest rates continue to be at historical lows. I reported just in a video or two back that inventory still remained uh, uh, tight, if you will, but demand is up. And, um, and we're just going to see a repeat of 2021 as we did in 2020. So, um, um, the, the real estate market just continues to be strong. I don't see, think we're going to see much change at all between the two years, being current year 2021 to last year of 2020. And for sure, there's not going to be a COVID-induced, if you will, uh, market downturn and uh, mortgage delinquencies and, um, and uh, people going belly up, if you will. It's just not going to happen. If we can help answer any questions for you, get you a market valuation, talk about maybe investing some money with, in, into real estate, we'd love to have that opportunity to have that conversation with you. Reach us at the office and you'll always get an answer from either myself or Teodora, 310-698-6444, 310-698-6444. Remember, for all your real estate needs, go to larockarealestate.com or go to livinginthesouthbay.com. You're gonna be real impressed with this new website. Talk soon.